Good morning. Thanks for starting your day with Denver 7 News. I'm Molly Hendrickson. And I'm Brian Sanders. Let's get right to our top stories. The All-Star Game festivities kick off today in downtown Denver with the opening of the fan experience called Playball Park. Inside and outside the convention center, fans will get their chance to hit, pitch, see memorabilia and exhibits, and get autographs and much more. Playball Park is free, but you do need tickets online. It runs through Tuesday. If you drive near the Central 70 project, there's a big closure this weekend. CDOT is closing Steel Street in both directions under I-70 this weekend. During the closure, crews will do demolition work on the old viaduct. CDOT says crews will work 24-7 throughout the weekend to ensure the work is done by Monday morning. The closure starts tonight at 8. Steel Street is set to reopen for the morning commute Monday morning at 5. The drought in the western United States has gotten much worse over the last year. Officials say 93% of the west is in a drought. That's double the area affected in 2020, and it's worse in the Pacific Northwest. The last time they were this dry was 1895. An analysis from more than two dozen scientists shows the current heat wave would have been virtually impossible without the effects of climate change. And we are under a Denver 7 weather action day. Here's meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo with your Denver 7 forecast. Yeah, it's going to be another hot one. We hit a high yesterday of 102 degrees. Today we're starting off in the 70s again. It's extremely comfortable out there, but this afternoon it isn't going to be. We're looking at again temperatures soaring out to near 100. Right now, Golden 73, Aurora near 70. Same thing to the north and Firestone. Boulder right now coming in at 81, 50s and 60s in the mountains. Here's a look at those highs again right around 100. Now the record high today is 98 and we're calling for a high of 99. So pretty good chance that we're going to break the record high this afternoon. So still under a Denver 7 weather action date. Now we saw a few gusty thunderstorms yesterday. Similar situation today. It is going to get a little cooler this weekend with 80s on Saturday and Sunday.